I was on the phone with my boyfriend and that was the last thing I remember. They don't know what happened. They just know I went down and my heart just stopped. So I was coming home from my son's karate dojo and we got diverted because there was uh, construction on the road that we normally take. Came around a roundabout and saw what I thought was uh, trash bags in the middle of the road. When I looked closer, it was actually a person. And so I got out of the car with my son and uh, she was not breathing and she had no pulse. Uh, I started doing CPR and there was a gentleman walking by uh, who was on his cell phone and I asked him to call 911. So I asked for them to send the medics and said she was uh, pulseless and not breathing. And so, you know, proceeded to do CPR for, it turns out, 18 minutes. I tried to go to a few fire stations that were close by to where um, I had given her CPR. And the, the firemen said, you know, there's no way to really know if you don't have her name, which I didn't. Um, and so I just resigned myself that I probably wouldn't ever know um, if she made it. It was amazing to, to learn that someone out of everything that could have gone down decided to help me in what was the most important time of my life at that time. So I just decided we would write up a little sign um, and we posted it, one right there and one over here. And apparently Carrie's husband was driving home one night, saw the sign, took a picture of it and sent it to her. And Getting that text at the end of the day, um, it was really amazing and a, and a little bit, it was overwhelming. I was really relieved because I'd thought about her a lot and woken up a lot in the middle of the night thinking about her and wondering if she had survived and if she did, if she was, if she had, you know, any major health issues. I contacted her later that night and we were able to talk. She, she's like, hi, is this Christy? <laughs> and I'm like, yes, it's like, hi, this is Carrie. I was the person who put, who did CPR on you. And I was just immediately in tears. It was really a nice Christmas gift and just a relief to know that she was, had survived. All of it's just unbelievable. I can't believe that I crossed paths with her like that. I, I don't know if I could have ha had anybody else walk by me that day to find me and it'd be in any better circumstances.